canola oil versus olive oil is one better than the other no they're both amazing but olive oil has definitely had better pr over the years so there are now enough clinical trials that there are meta-analyses comparing the health effects of olive oil and canola oil to other types of fats and oils and we basically see that olive oil and canola oil need to need to share that first place platform for the healthiest fats to consume along with uh, the omega-3s that we're getting from seafood and from nuts and seeds like flaxseed, chia seed, and walnuts. So those are the healthiest fats, oleic acid. Canola oil, by the way, is 66-ish percent oleic acid and olive oil is 60 to 80 percent oleic acid. So canola oil is right up there. It's a very interesting composition. It's also 7 to 15 percent uh, omega-3s, alpha-linolenic acid, and only 20% linoleic acid. So canola oil also is, is really cool because it has these other fats and it's one of the highest phytosterol fats and phytosterols have a very, um, they have a structure that's like cholesterol. So they basically interfere with cholesterol reabsorption in the digestive tract and help lower our cholesterol. So canola oil has been shown to have uh, health benefits, reducing cardiovascular disease risk, cardiovascular disease mortality, all cause mortality and uh, type 2 diabetes risk. So canola oil and olive oil um, seem to work differently, but are about equally beneficial. And what that means, because they actually work through some slightly different pathways, is it means that avoiding one, which we know which one most people are avoiding, right? And only focusing on the other is not as good as making room for both of them in our diets. So obviously one is a lot more expensive than the other, um, but they're both good. So choose the oil option that you like, have access to, and can afford.